Devanelli is a small town, population about 30,000. Its uh, claim to fame is Tipu Sultan was uh, born there, there's a heritage site. We built for the community a green patch of land, but in reality, it's a first of its kind fecal slush treatment plant. I think it is a big contribution to moving sanitation forward in India. Fecal sludge is collected in uh, desludging vehicles. We call them uh, honey suckers. And these desludging vehicles bring the fecal sludge to the treatment plant. Solid stream goes into anaerobic digestion. There is biogas produced, and then it's further treated uh, in stabilized in anaerobic reactors. Finally, it's dried in a drying bed and it's ready for co-composting where it's mixed with uh, organic municipal waste and co-composted into uh, useful uh, soil manure or a compost for farmers to use. Um, this uh, cycle balances the uh, nutrient requirements of the soil that's depleted through agriculture and overuse. When we started the process of building the uh, fecal slush treatment plant, the first question that came up was, how much fecal slush does a town like Devanelli actually generate? And uh, there were no good answers, so we ended up doing a full census of the Devanelli town. Three key insights emerged from this. The first being, householders take very long time between desludging, which causes the actual desludging operation to be much more difficult than it can be. Number two, no desludging operator would like to travel a long distance before emptying their truck. Number three, the biggest problem of fecal sludge management is the lack of a proper disposal point for the desludging operators. Devanelli Patana dalle, ipatmoru vadagalle, seedi di samastha var bandu. Namga namma prasa belli matar daga nau janda travagi, janda travada viroda mardro, a viroda mard daga nau yen mardve jana. Now, we have to meet the residents in the meeting. Our solution tried to address these by bringing a plant close to the source of the fecal sludge, making it good looking, odor free, and acceptable to the community. The next step in this process is uh, identifying and acquiring land. And there is a series of approvals, checking for ownership and legal access and road access, planning and zoning authority approvals, pollution control board approvals to start construction. It uh, resides next to National Highway and uh, it was uh, very easy for us to maintain also. And uh, this land, earlier it was a landfill, uh, land dump, waste dumping site, and which we have cleared it and uh, we have leveled it for this uh, implementation of this plan. Another important step uh, along the process is for the local government to create a regulatory environment under which the fecal sludge management system can, uh, can function sustainably. Uh, right from the beginning, we worked with the town of Devanelli as a partner. They have passed four resolutions. Number one, proper regulation of the containment systems that are going to be built for new houses. Number two, licensing and regulation of private operators working in the town of Devanelli for desludging. Number three, for the treatment plant, uh, outsourcing the operations of the treatment plant to private operators and of course raising uh, property taxes to support the costs of the treatment plant. Now that the uh, regulatory framework is in place, a few more practical interventions are required to effectively implement these on the ground. Uh, for example, the calls coming in from the household uh, can be routed to a call center. Uh, number two, GPS devices and cameras can be placed on the truck in order to monitor their uh, desludging and disposal. This, in the long run, uh, can also lead to regular desludging. Number three, a treatment plant can be monitored for input and output parameters so it meets standards. Nano septic tank driver, Sumara R hours in the septic tank outside in a R hours in the Sumara outside now, he managed the sludge to Mukondoge. Barakade, he thought of taking total bit of the way. Ega Devonali, he septic tanks, Lurjo, Planta, Melan, Amtumba, and Kulagi there. Mathe septic tanks do our training Ella Koti there. Mathe Namga, Kavurku, Kalsugu, Jasiagi there. These plants are not expensive at all, and most municipalities uh, can afford these plants. The operating costs. Uh, were kept low, there's only one operator in the plant, the whole plant runs on gravity. 
doesn't use any electricity for operations and hence is effective, cheap and arrests pollution quickly. Regarding the operation and maintenance of this plant, we are raising money through uh, selling manure and through advertisement and through property tax and also through uh, collecting fees for the sludge. Farmers are also very happy because of the good quality manure, organic manure in a cheaper price. In Devanhalli, we work with the farmers, bringing to them the benefits of using fecal sludge compost. I am a farmer, 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 I am a we work with the uh, women's uh, self-help groups, uh, trying to build awareness around how to use the toilets. We have worked with every stakeholder uh, involved with uh, the sanitation value chain and talk to them not only about the fecal sludge management interventions, but also about the larger sanitation messages. The sanitation has improved a lot from the fecal sludge treatment plant because it's end-to-end -end solution. And we are providing information, education, and communication related to this sanitation issues. This has helped us more and more. We are very much happy and we are most, con most contented about it. Uh, we have attracted attention from decision makers at, at uh, higher levels of official dump from different states, um, Tamil Nadu, Rajasthan, uh, Andhra Pradesh, all of them have uh, shown great interest in taking these ideas forward. Fecal sludge management is a very good first step in bringing sanitation to a large majority of people quickly. We believe actually that in five years, we can cover 100% uh, of, of India with fecal sludge management systems. And we will have uh, our vision of a clean and green India coming to us much faster.